today is one of those days when Amal and I are going to one of the flooring shops yet again hopefully to finally make a decision on what floor type, color, size, shape to go for. We have looked at floors multiple times already. We know what type, we know what brand we're gonna go for. Now the decision is for us to choose what shade to go for. Strongly considering going for the grayish type. We both like it a lot, but then when we got the sample, it almost feels like they're a little bit too gray. Well, not this one specifically, a few other ones that I'm holding here. We just need to figure it out. And the best way to figure this out is to go directly to the shop and see the full size version on the floor, because that way the light will fall a certain way and it will just make more sense rather than looking at these little samples that get sent. It's just not good enough to make a decision. Today, we're going to be going down to the shop. Also, we're going to be making my dream come true and we're going to be going to Ikea as well. Amon asked me not to buy anything today. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Oh, it's so soft. Yeah. Almost too soft. Oh my god. Oh my god, this is such a soft sofa. Now, I don't remember how soft the other one that we liked was. What if this sofa is softer? I really like this one. Like, do you remember how soft that one was? I can't remember it correctly. Yeah, that's the point, that's the problem. This one is a bit, it sinks too much a bit. No, it's perfect. Oh, this feels very good. I don't want to move. I guess I'll just let Amon walk around everywhere in the shop and just choke here on the sofa. In the past, I always thought that using the various things like getting a coffee in a furniture store, it's a little bit like taking advantage of the facilities. But if I was to invest in one of their sofas, which would be worth like 5k, can I please get this tea? This, the cost of this coffee is what? Sugar doesn't come out. Just live your life. Get tea and coffee from places like this if they're on offer and oh. The problem is they don't have sticks. How am I supposed to? Hmm. Okay. While Ahmad is talking to the carpet man here, I think I've found the perfect solution to what he's trying to get. So he's trying to get like a really flushy carpet, but I just found the plushest carpet and I really want to film his reaction to it. Look at this. Look at this. Oh my god. Oh my god. So good. What are these? <laughs> rugs. This is the plushest carpet you'll ever get. So these are rugs, not carpets. But yeah, yeah they're, it's they're a rug. Extremely fluffy. This is the fluffiest version. So you think you have just one, just one like of these and then a regular One of this and just a regular LVT floor. And, and look how plush it is. You just put the floor down and then you will get what you want with the softness and I'll get what it's, I it's, want. It's, it's very soft. It's, <laughs> it's amazing, right? I am convinced that we need to be doing the laminate flooring in the cinema room and putting the plush carpet. It's the plushest carpet we've ever seen and felt and it's so nice. We are going to a Sophology shop next to look at more sofas. I cannot look at sofas anymore. I'm t like, that Mary, sofa was so good, but we're still going because just in case, just in case. What if we see something different that will be like mind blowing? So. Butt blowing. <laughs> I want to recognize yourself. Ooh, you got excited about something. Oh, it is cool. If you give Aman anything that has a USB plug and a like something else, you lose his mind. Lose his mind. <laughs> that was fast. It looks nice. You sit down and you never get up. Do you know what we've done? We've made the biggest mistakes of our life right now yeah. by seeing the sofa, sitting down on the sofa, and now we love it so much that I don't even I can't compare this one to the one we originally chose, and it's a problem because we'll need to go all the way to that other shop to compare it. So I don't like, know. It's more remarkably different softness. It's both very, very comfortable. comfortable. You can bet how comfortable each one are. They're both very comfortable. No, you can't compare. You look at the looks and the style. But the looks, the... both of them are looking good. It doesn't have a chase and so on. 
having had a really good food at Nando's, having been to two or three sofa places, having almost changed our minds on the carpet situation and the sofa situation, we got to the flooring supplies where we will be making our decision. Finally, I hope on what floor to go with. This is it, this is the one that we want. This is Twilight Oak. Pearl Oak, Twilight Oak. So, we wanted to go for either French Grey Oak or Twilight Oak, which is much darker. And I'm not too sure. Well, this one, this one looks nice as well. No. We're with a half five. Good, I'll come with this one. This one's very, this one we wanted to try. Yeah, this one, what to see this one. It's a browner version of this one. But it's not, this one's not a bad. That exactly. Sample. The sample looks different. Okay. Isn't it going to be a little too dark? Look, we can get to Raven Oak for a cinema room. I still don't know which one to go for. Lucy Longboard book. <laughs> it's my favorite thing. Look, it has the back of it, it has a different form. I love this. It feels like, yeah, it feels like it's surreal. And you said, and every time I touch this one, it feels like it's plastic, like literally. When you have, but this is because it's so thick that it's actually this thin. Yeah, I know, I know. Oh, okay. I got this one. I wonder if they have exactly the same shade of it. We explained that we're actually very interested between these two ones and we really need to understand them. Okay, so what's happening right now is we're making a plan how to get the book. The book that I'm going to add to his it collection. It makes my, my ADHD brain just so happy just to see the tactile, visual. Look, show them the camera. Look at this. We may be buying wood. If there's, if there's a discount. Sure. If there's a discount. But also, check out this really strange it feels interesting and it almost is very satisfying to my brain. Yeah, this is how the book feels to me. <laughs> this is how the book feels oh, to me. Oh, this is good. This one's good. I don't know. I want something back in the sink to catch a splash back when you, you brush your teeth and put it everywhere. I want you on the walls. They told us the wood that we want, no one ever buys. So it's a little so bit it's concerning. It's exclusive VIP. <laughs> they don't buy it because he tells them not. <laughs> I'm going to the cinema, but what are, your, what are your thoughts on this? Um, have, I was pointing out here a, a bigger discount, like apprentice style, go get a bespoke discount. <laughs> the only discount they offer is discount they offer to everyone, not because of specifically us in the situation and stuff. That's the kind of discount you can get if they have stock in their shop or something that they're holding on to and they want to get rid of that stock, but none of the stock is here. So they only give us the flat 5% discount, which is basically like the discount we already had via email. They said that discount that we got via email, the 5% was for apologizing for not giving them a sample. They just account. always have but the same discount. But, but they just the, say this no, to us. No, but it's the discount that you would have got if uh, you bought anywhere. it in the shop anyway. Yeah, yeah, so it's not, we're not special. I'm not apologizing to us. I'll say 5% and 5%, yeah, yeah, 10%, 10%. If he gives me 10% off the 40 pound glue, great. That's like, what? Thing is, I didn't like this guy. I really didn't like this guy. Do you know why I didn't like this guy? Because you're so fucking sexist. He did not look at me once. Did you ask him any questions? Once. When he was talking about the wood and the pricing and everything for the whole 20 minutes, he was just looking at Aman. That's not good. Mm. For that reason, we're not going to buy him from this shop. We'll find another district. It's this not is the, the only, only shop place. For place in the whole no, place. I just went on, on the side and there was a few. So I don't feel comfortable. <laughs> I'm pissed off. When you can go. Instead? from somebody else. Oh, you mean from this company yeah. in general? Yeah. Holy shit. Yeah, look, you cannot just blatantly ignore me. I'm then he just looking at him and talking to him about the word. Like, what the fuck? Zero, zero respect. What Where are we are doing? Going? Going. Let's go Adidas. What do, you, what do you mean going Adidas? We have no time. He got so mad right now. He tells us that no one ever has bought this floor, ever. From me. 
for me is like, oh, maybe it's because no one ever bought Is it because you are terrible at your sales sticking? Is it no, because all of those people no, who I wanted to buy this floor was women and everyone got pissed off? Huh? No, I know the reason why. He, no one ever bought this floor from him specifically because he doesn't know about the product features of this floor. He, he said it initially that this type of one loose lay is kind of a temporary flooring that is not, it's going to move around a bit. But I know that for a fact to not be true because we know that the this is about easy installation, but it still has connection method where you sort of have this rubber backing and plus the, some glue. Not real glue, but like this other liquid thing. That does just as good a job as a glue down or a click lock system or whatever. And he said that they more like to move around and stuff. And um, so he also said that people just put it in as a temporary solution before they get in uh, the wood. Why would, why would, like, why would people fuck? pay 50 pounds per meter for, for a temporary wood? Also, he didn't give me the book. Uh, That's the biggest sin. He should just give me the fucking book. Get another book. Just say we lost it, counting. We lost the book. Because this guy really wanted a book. He'd be so happy with the book. He didn't give me the fucking book. I'm sure his colleague would have given me the book. Book with a word and stuff in it. I wanted a little <laughs> tactile book. It's like. It's, it's like a Blu ray set for Evangelion. It's that. It's more complex. It's like. It's like it has the open. Open again. Open one more. And then a, Okay, back onto the IKEA thing. We are late. We spent too much time on the sofa. I thought my dream will come true to life today. Me going to IKEA. No, you, need to, you need to understand. You have to see the IKEA. Look how big it is. Imagine what's inside. And then, no. And then... So this is a DFS here. Look, it showed the DFS. So basically. You were saying earlier that you can't really compare the sofas because you, you sat on this so long ago. But since you sat on the other sofa from the other shop earlier today, your bum will remember and the bum will tell the difference between the sofa we liked and, and the sofa at the other shop. And we can re-examine whether it is the sofa for us. <laughs> By re-examine, I mean a tactile re-examining, not a visual re-examining. It all looked very good to the eye. And see it on the website. I can't sit on the website. <laughs> see it, say it, sort it. <laughs> See it, say it, sit on it. <laughs> yeah, that's what it should be. Yeah, that's what it should be. Okay, honestly, so just find the sofa and in and out, in and out. Oh, it's there, see, yeah, see. Oh, it's so good. It's, it's the best. It's the one, definitely, yeah. We shouldn't have gone to DFS, now we're doubting all our decisions. No, you needed to go there, otherwise you, what if you sat on it and doubt it after you bought it? I still stand by that so far, it I'm wasn't... Not against it either. Now we're going to cinema. Because it's for me? This move? Huh? This is your dad's glory hallelujah moment. And away from boy Sammy, does that guy ever deserve it? Welcome to my party, we're just getting started, a life is a dream.